On the night of uh, March the 4th, there was a serious fire on our estate in 18 Maddox House. We are anomanic ami basai dukse sare barotar dike ara itar dike hotat kore shobdo shuru hoyechil ektu electric sparkling shobdo to ami upor theke bang bed er upor theke niche takai dekhe niche hoyteche apnar firework er moto aguner phul ki ber hocche ar sathe dhua sada dhua theke hotat kore mane moment er bhitore chokher poloker bhitore sada dhua kalo hoye gelo ar pura ghor chhe geche apnar dhua those time i was in outside of the house i am returned from job and finding the police officer and uh, community people poroborti tai se dekha gelo je mizan bhai name ekjon ashchilo she ber hoyte pare nai apni chokher samne dekhte chen ekta agun jolte sar apni feel korte chen je oider bhitore akhon ekta manush ache mane bole bojhano somvob na chilo oirate ki hoychilo amader shobai what we discovered on that night and the day subsequently that there was extreme overcrowding in that flat on our estate overcrowded bolte chen extreme level er crowded hoye jaito যখন ধরেন স্টুডেন্ট আসার সিজন হয় যেন সেপ্টেম্বরে জানুয়ারিতে ওই সময় এক একটা সিঙ্গেল রুমে আপনাদের বেড আছে হয়তো আছে আটটা বাট আমরা থাকছি দশজন বারোজন পর্যন্ত কেউ ফ্লোরে থাকছে সিঙ্গেল বেড দুইটা মোটা মোটা মানুষ শেয়ার করে থাকছে ইভেন কিচেনে পর্যন্ত লোক থাকছে এক একজন নাইনটি পাউন্ড করে প্রত্যেক সপ্তাহে We estimate that the landlord was making up to £10,000 a month off a single two-bedroom property on our estate. The fire was a shock, but what we've discovered since is even more shocking. At the moment, we don't have any house. We are homeless. I'm going in a police station and police said go in council and council said go in police station. I think what Ms. Anul's case so far shows us is that his death perhaps could have been prevented um, and no one should live in an overcrowded home. Um, no one should have to face extortionate rents um, without caps. Um, and people, all people up and down the country from any background need a safe place to live.